Hello friends. In this lecture we are going to talk about Elgamal crypto system and we'll also see how to encrypt and decrypt using the Elgamal crypto system. So in cryptography the Elgamal encryption system is an asymmetric key encryption algorithm for public key cryptography which is based on the Diffie-Hellman key exchange. If you don't remember Diffie-Hellman key exchange I'll provide you the link on the top right corner you can visit the video and check what is Duffy Hellman key exchange. Okay, so this system provides an additional layer of security by asymmetrically encrypting keys previously used for symmetric message encryption. Okay, so in Elgamal, in, in Elgamal the encryption consists of three components. Part one, part one, is key generator part 2 is encryption algorithm and part 3 is decryption algorithm okay the algorithm crypto system is threefold part 1 part 2 part 3 so here what happens is that we have public keys P, G and Y and one private key X. Okay. So now what happens is that we will be generating one of the public keys because we will be already provided with the P and G. We might sometimes be given Y but also we might not given Y sometimes. So we need to calculate or we need to find a way that how to find the value of Y. Okay, so we have a formula for that. What does this public key mean is that when suppose when Alice wants to send a message to Bob so Alice will encrypt using its public key and Bob will decrypt it using its public as well as the private key okay so now one of the way to find the value y is which is also known as the first step that is key generator so let's let's calculate it with the help of an example only okay so we have g is equal to 3 we have p is equal to 101 we have k is equal to 6 we have our message the plain text is equal to 5 and we have our private key x is equal to 2 okay so to generate y how will we be generating y is step one it will be equal to g raised to x mod p so what is our g over here it is three what is x two mod one or one which will be equal to nine mod one or one as nine is already inside one or one so it will all directly be the answer so our y the third public key value is 9 there will be times where you will be provided with y and if you are not provided then this is the formula to calculate the y g raised to x mod p okay now part 2 encryption so encryption is done in two way because for encryption we need two values R and C let's call it C1 the cipher text we need two values R and C so to calculate R we have the formula as G raised to K mod P 
so it will be equal to 3 raised to 6 because we have our values mod 101 if you calculate it your r will be equal to 22 so 3 raised to 6 divide by 101 minus 7 into 101 22 see that's our answer to calculate the another part the small c we have the value message m into y raised to k mod p which will be equal to 5 into 9 raised to 6 mod 101 so let us calculate that 9 raised to 6 into 5 divided by 101 minus before decimal value so it is 26308 into 101 96.99999 so it will be equal to 97 so our c1 is r comma c which will be equal to 22 comma 97 on encryption we got these two values now when bob wants to decrypt the message so at the time of decryption what happens is let's see so for decryption d we have the value as small c into r raised to p minus 1 minus x mod p to decrypt this is the formula okay so what is c 97 what is r 22 raised to p 101 minus 1 minus x is our 2 mod 101 which will be equal to 97 raised to 22 raised to 98 mod 101 now to solve 22 raised to 98 is very huge so we factorize it okay so how will we doing it is 97 into 22 raised to 7 mod 101 whole raised to 40 mod 101 okay so 14 7s are 98 so let's solve this one first so 22 raised to 7 divide by 101 minus 2 4 6 9 6 6 1 2 into 101 is equal to 76 so this will become as 97 into 76 raised to 14 because this entire value is 76 mod 101 now also 76 raised to 14 is a bigger number so what we will be doing is that we will be calculating 76 raised to 10 separately and 76 raised to 4 separately so we get it as 14 so 76 raised to 5 mod 101 square so it is 5 to the 10 76 raised to 10 into 76 raised to 4 mod 101 so 5 to the 10 plus 4 14 so 76 raised to 14 we just again factorized it to write it in a simpler manner okay so when you calculate 76 raised to 5 divide by 101 minus 2510421 into 101 is 65 so 97 into 65 square into 76 raised to 4 so 76 raised to 4 divided by 101 minus 3303188 into 101 
57.9999 it means 58 mod 101 okay so 65 into 65 into 58 into 97 divide by 101 minus 235345 into 101 5 so on decrypting we got the value 5 which was actually our message 5 so we have done the calculation accurately so that the plain text that we sent was also 5 and the message after decryption we got is also 5 okay so this was all about algamal crypto system thank you